All right, guys. Well, thank you for joining us tonight. Um, I want to take your time and say this conversation is probably the number two or three searched conversation uh, on Google right now. And what is that? That's called what are ketones? What is ketosis? What is intermittent fasting? What is fasting? That whole keto intermittent fasting terminology is being Googled like crazy and has just become a firestorm of a search uh, for the probably the last three and a half to four years and getting bigger and bigger. Uh, I started in this conversation about four years ago, uh, actually about four and a half years ago, and I, I said no to ketones and ketosis for about a year and a half. Uh, the reason why? Uh, because it only meant cutting out carbs and trying to lose weight. Well, I wasn't in a bad place with carbohydrates. I mean, I didn't have a bad relationship with carbohydrates. And I also was not looking to lose weight. And I actually enjoy carbs, <laughs> if that makes sense, which I think a lot of us do. Uh, what There's two different types of carbohydrates. There's simple and there's complex carbohydrates. Uh, obviously, we want complex carbohydrates, not simple carbohydrates, i.e. sugar. But do I still have a healthy balance around carbohydrates? Yes. So we have... Now, because of technology and research, come upon this conversation of, ex of exogenous ketones that was only, you could only talk about ketones if you're in ketogenesis slash ketosis. Well, in order to get into ketosis, you had to get into ketogenesis. In order to get into ketogenesis, you had to stop eating carbohydrates altogether, which means zero carbs, and what does that mean? That means you have to burn through glucose. Glucose is a fuel source that your body primarily runs off of because you eat carbs. But when you quit eating carbs, you cut off a, full, a fuel supply. Well, the body is efficient and has actually two fuel sources that it runs on. And you actually started life in ketosis, believe it or not. In the first stages of life, for the first six to nine months, if you were a breastfed baby, the only fuel source you ran off of was ketones. That is proven, that is scientific research, that is valid evidence uh, that shows every baby that is breastfed in this world starts out life running on ketones is in a, in a state of ketosis. Now, what does terminology mean around ketosis? It means you have a medically elevated level of ketones in your blood. That terminology used to be synonymous with ketogenesis, which meant you were a fat burner. Ketogenesis means you're metabolizing fat to produce ketones that put you into ketosis. Well, now, today, you can be in ketosis in 45 minutes by drinking exogenous ketones, pure therapeutic ketones, which means I can put bioidentical ketones in your blood in 30 to 45 minutes by this drink. It's simple. It's easy, it's effective, and it's proven because I can test my blood. Why is that such a big deal? Well, it means you don't have to cut out carbohydrates. It means you don't have to starve yourself. It means that your body gets rocket fuel instantaneously without going through what we call a metabolic shift that usually takes people, the average person, seven to 10 days. I've had buddies that have done it naturally that have taken them up to 21, 30 days. Um, if you do fasting or intermittent fasting, you could get there faster, which means you're just burning through glucose faster to get into metabolizing fat. But here's the thing about all those things, all the day, all the time frames, all the parameters to do it naturally. It's hard. I don't know how many people have cut out carbohydrates and tried to run on zero carbs until your body starts metabolizing fat to produce ketones, but I have and it's hard and it's not something i like and it's not something i enjoy and it's not something i'm fun to be around to be honest with you uh because we all get hangry we all get tired we all get lethargic we all get weak we all get just a number of different things as the body has to metabolically shift well here's one of the cool things about why this drink is such a big deal is because it's not just formulated and let's go you know put it in the marketplace this formula this product right here this drink is available to us now because of the U.S. Department of Naval Research and the University of South Florida with Dr. Dominic Diagostino. Why do those two things come into play? Because U.S. Department of Naval Research is the backing organization of our Navy SEALs. The Navy SEALs were going into seizures underwater using a rebreather apparatus. Dr. Dominic 
D'Agostino is a ketogenic expert. They knew that research had shown that keto, I guess the keto diet and people in ketosis had shown really good results around neurological brain activity. So they said, is there some way to formulate a product that can help our Navy SEALs not go into seizures because they're not getting enough oxygen through a rebreather and not make them do a ketogenic diet and not starve them of carbohydrates because they're extreme living conditions and travel conditions and all those things. Dr. Don Diagosino said, let's do it. Let's try to see if we can figure it out. Uh, he did it in conjunction with a couple of other scientists and researchers. And you now have a drinkable ketone source that puts you into ketosis in 30 to 45 minutes, which then changed the oxygen makeup of these Navy SEALs blood, which provided 30 to 40% more oxygen to the brain, which then 100% treated them of their, uh, what shall we call their seizures, um, that was really debilitating them. And it not only changed the seizure makeup by going away completely, it increased their performance at the same time. So the US department got smart and patented the product. They patented the formulation of this. We bought the patent, prove it, bought the patent, and now we've taken it to market. Why is that a big deal? Because we now have nine patents on this product. We originally started with the US Department of Naval Research patent in the University of South Florida. We have now, with our scientists and researchers uh, and doctors, have now formulated it in about nine different ways and have enhanced it to the process of now nine different patents. And we are the only company in the marketplace that can give you medically elevated level of ketones and one serving within 30 to 45 minutes. So here's what we're talking about. Do you need to follow a diet? No. Do you need to drink these at a certain time? No, not ideally. Do you need to do anything specific in order to get the benefits of drinking this product? No. So what does this product really, I mean, where is the sign, where, where's the optimal place of why I want to introduce this product into my body? Well, one, because your body prefers ketones because I told you you started life in ketosis and running on ketones and to still until you started eating processed foods, baby foods, anything that was processed that had carbohydrates or sugars in it, did your body start metabolizing sugars instead of ketones? So with all that to be said, your body thrives on ketones. Your body actually enhances its overall makeup when it runs on the proper fuel source. Well, to make that a little bit more relatable, think of your body as a Ferrari, as a Lamborghini, as some high-end sports car. You drive that sports car off the lot, and the one thing they tell you is you cannot put anything in that car except high octane. You cannot put low octane in a Ferrari, you cannot put low octane in a Lamborghini, you cannot put low octane in a Bugatti, in a Bentley, in a Corvette, I mean, guys, they are high performance vehicles that run on high octane. Well, your body is a high performance vehicle, but yet we choose to put what in it? Junk, sugar, carbohydrates, things that are not high octane. So how can we combat that? Well, drink this first thing in the morning after you're in a fasted state. So the average person say sleeps eight hours. Some will sleep six, some will sleep 10. You wake up in a fasted state. Your body's already depleted some glucose. You automatically put high octane fuel in it. It's like turning on the light bulb for not only your body, but it starts here. It starts in the brain. Everything that your body functions off of starts by the signaling process up here. So if we can increase blood flow and oxygen to the brain that changes the whole makeup of how the body functions, then obviously the entire body benefits. And whether that be from just having better hormonal balance to having better energy to having a better functionality, functionality as uh, internal aspects go. But also, here's one of the really cool things. If I'm giving you a fuel source that you would normally have to go eat or try to start yourself to produce, does that mean you probably need to eat if I'm giving you fuel? No. So it's actually thinking about this in another way of, okay, I can drink this, get premier rocket fuel, 
and I don't need to go eat anything. How does that make sense, Shane? Because calories count, right? Well, calories only count because of fuel. Well, if I can give you 45 calories worth of premium octane fuel, that's all you need. And at the end of the day, what we're trying to get you to understand is that your body thrives by running on ketones and you don't need all the excess calories. Is this a weight loss product? I would say no. Does it help or support you in weight loss? Absolutely. Because if I can get you to stop eating calories that aren't sufficiently going to give you anything of what you're looking for at the end, you can't eat anything that's going to give you ketones, but you can drink them or you can metabolize fat to produce them. Well, now that's a win. And I can reduce your calories and keep your energy level up where it needs to be. That's a win. So here's the big thing that I want to make sure that everybody understands. Drinking ketones doesn't make you a fat burner. But drinking ketones gets you to being a fat burner a lot faster if I can get you to start reducing your carbohydrates. Drinking ketones gives you instantaneous energy and fuel in a, what we call compliance within the body so that you start functioning as the body should. See, glucose actually shuts down a lot of things in the body. Glucose actually creates inflammation. Ketones are anti-inflammatory product. Ketones enhance blood flow to the brain. Ketones actually reduce the acidity within the body. We all know that a, an acidic body is kind of like a disease-ridden body. It's also a body that can be very um, quickly affected uh, when it comes to illnesses or sicknesses. Uh, ketones create a neutral pH balance in the body, which is huge, huge, huge. From a performance standpoint, if I can give you fuel that enhances oxygen in the blood, that means it goes all the way through the extremities, anywhere the blood goes, which is every part of your body, well, that enhances performance at the same time. How does ketones keep me from losing muscle, Shane? How do ketones keep me from being hungry? How do ketones help me just in general be better in life? A couple of those things have been answered, but the one thing that I think is the best way to kind of explain this, I'm gonna use nature. And think about it like this, guys. What do bears do every single year? Bears go and eat a lot, a lot of high fat foods, i.e. named salmon, right? Or a high fatty fish or something that's got a lot of fat to it that maybe, you know, is gonna have a lot of fats because their body is storing it for what? What do bears do after they're done eating? What do they do in wintertime? They go and hibernate. Well, if they're hibernating, what are they doing? They're living in a state of ketogenesis because they're not eating. They have to find fuel somewhere. What are they doing? They're metabolizing fat. Why are they metabolizing fat? Because they need fuel to run their bodies while they sleep for three, four, five months. At the same time, they have little cubs. And these little cubs are doing what? These cubs are feeding on the mom while they're in hibernation. What are the cubs doing? Living in ketosis. Guys, I give you that example because that's the most natural source of an example of why ketones have been around since the beginning of time. It's what your body thrives off of. I can't tell if you drank ketones or if you did a ketogenic diet or if you just did fasting to get your body to start producing ketones. Because once I prick your finger and I do a blood test, that blood test is going to show either ketones in your blood or it's not. And it's either going to show that you have been metabolizing fat and producing ketones or it's going to show that you drank ketones. I don't know the difference between either one. It's just going to show me ketones. So therein lies the benefit of why this is so evident of being a premier fuel source. Because guys, honestly, I can't, we can't test a protein shake. I can't test a vitamin. I can't test a mineral. I can't test anything that you eat as if it's actually, if your body's actually utilizing it and doing anything with it. But I can test your blood in 45 minutes and I can prove to you that this product is bioidentically in your blood and doing exactly what I told you it would do and what research and science has told you would do, and what your body has said it's wanted to do since the beginning of time. So I say all this to go back and reiterate the fact that when do I take this? Whenever you want. Ideally, it's first thing in the morning when you wake up. How many times do I drink it, Shane? Ideally, I would drink it twice a day. 
That's me. Can I drink it more than twice a day? Absolutely. I've had up to four or five of these in a day when I've been fasting all day. Can I have it multiple days in a row when I'm fasting? Absolutely. We just actually completed our keto reboot system. This is available till 11.59 tonight. It's $79. It's a two day fasting kit and it's about rebooting your body. So our two day keto reboot system is done in a community format. We only make it available for a couple days every month, but you get to experience ketones, the keto bone broth, our signal OS, a lot of benefits to the keto OS pro. We have a whey protein isolate combined with ketones as well that you will break your fast with after 60 hours. Guys, this is a huge, huge system that I would encourage you to jump in and try tonight before it goes uh, away. We'll come back at the beginning of May, but again, we're doing a big keto reboot in the big in the middle of May, May 17th. So you wanna go ahead and get your keto reboot system now for $79. Again, 22% discount on this product tonight. Here's the other thing, guys, what better way to try ketones than doing a 10 day drink ketone challenge? Why would I wanna do a 10 day drink ketone challenge? Is because it actually gives you five different flavors. This is kind of like a flavor experience, to be honest with you. This gives you five different flavors over 20 packets. So you're actually getting four packets of every flavor. Two are charged, two are non-charged. What is this gonna do for me? It's actually gonna give you an experience in 10 days to drink two a day so that you really get to see the, bull, the full benefits of ketones. And it also gives you a way to kind of pick a flavor. Uh, we honestly have 16 different flavors or more. Uh, we actually have eight available on the website. They, these are five of the eight that we have available. And then we run what we call seasonal flavors. Uh, we just actually launched a strawberry peach flavor, sold out in 24 hours. If that gives you any kind of idea about how hot our new flavors are and what we're doing, uh, this is ultimately fast food to health. That's really what it is because here's the really cool part. Guys, I tear open a packet of this. I mix it with this. I shake it up. I drink it. I'm done. That's the simplicity of it. This is fast food to health. It doesn't get any simpler, it doesn't get any easier, it doesn't get any faster, and it doesn't get any more bioidentical and testable than what we have in this system. Again, I'm super excited that you're checking out this conversation because this is a conversation that I said no to for a year and a half, and I'm kind of bummed I did say no for a year and a half, but I just didn't know what I didn't know. And I've been in the fitness industry for 25 years. I kind of know a lot of things, I've seen a lot of things, but I didn't know it all. And I didn't know that my body was starting out in ketosis in the beginning stages of life. I didn't know that my body actually pre preferred ketones. Now today, I run on ketones all day, every day. This is my second serving of ketones today. It's six o'clock at night. I'm enjoying the day. I've already had uh, one meal today. I ate um, brisket and jalapeno sausage. I'm a meat guy. I love meat, but I didn't have any carbohydrates. I drink lots of water. I drink a lot of ketones. I have a healthy balance around sugar and carbohydrates. Does that mean I'm, I never eat sugar? No, I, my birthday was yesterday. I had a red velvet cream cheese bunt cake that I absolutely crushed. That's okay. But I mean, that's a part of understanding that this process of how you build your relationship around food is just realizing that there's a healthy balance with everything. Can you mess this up? I think that's one of the biggest questions I get. Can you mess this up? Can I mess it up by eating something? Can I mess it up by drinking it at a certain time? No, no, and no. Because whether you ate a whole pizza and drank ketones, you have glucose and ketones in your body, your body recognizes the ketones and wants to use them. Will you still use glucose as well? Absolutely. But your body prefers the ketones, so it's gonna use that as the primary fuel source. So all I'm saying is that there's different ways to apply this you just have to decide on what way you want it to be applied in your life. For me, it's overall health and wellness. For me, it's always about just to taking less stress off of my digestive system. That's why the Keto Reboot is into play. It gives your digestive system a chance to relax and it gives your digestive system a chance to reboot itself. Keto Reboot. Um, why is fasting so big? And I think it's important that I share this with you guys is because science and research has shown Phenomenal internal benefits in the medical community around fasting. Why? 
because one of the biggest things that we have going on right now is a, an attack on our immune system. Well, doctors have seen that if you fast for 72 hours, you can re completely reset your white blood cell count. 72 hours, what does that mean? That's three days. Three days of fasting and you can completely reset your white blood cells. White blood cells are our number one defense mechanism to our health. So is fasting good for us? Absolutely. Can I do it on just ketones alone? Absolutely. So I think it's important for everybody to realize there's so much information out there and, and we're inviting people to just be educated. That's all we want people to do. We want you to be educated. We want you to have the information. We also want you to just have an experience. I've always said, have an experience. Let your body tell you how you feel. And I know for me, it was one serving of ketones. They said, Shane, drink them. Don't eat till you're hungry. I was like, that's crazy. I'm going to eat at least five times today. So I'm going to be hungry in about two hours. So I drank my first serving at six o'clock. I had a workout from six to seven. I didn't think about food till three o'clock in the afternoon. And I only thought about food because I was like, I haven't eaten today. Not because I was hungry. It was just that I hadn't eaten today. And I was like, okay, that's crazy. You, can, you can't trick my body for eight hours to not eat. You can stimulate me for a little bit to not eat, but for eight hours, something's truly speaking to me and telling me I'm okay. Something's truly speaking to me and telling me my body's good. So I think there's such a huge benefit to understanding experience outweighs anything. So why not? Why not have an experience? Why not see what this is all about? And why not take the conversation and go, you know what? I just didn't know what I didn't know. That was me. And so it gave me information to start learning more, educating myself, and start really understanding the benefits of how we live a longevity life that is full of life, right? And that's what I want to invite everybody to. Uh, we're just trying to make sure that everybody has the adequate amount of information so that you can live the best life possible and that you can enjoy even a better life, believe it or not. Um, and, and there always is another day to just get better. Uh, it's hard to believe as I'm aging in life, I'm actually feeling younger in life. I'm actually doing better in life. I, I've never been in a bad shape, but I also realized that age is just a number and age is just something that I'm always kind of challenging myself with by just staying ahead of the curve. And the best way to cheat death, think about this, the best way to cheat death, live a healthy lifestyle. Because that's the one thing you can control. You actually can control everything that goes in your mouth, what you eat, and what you drink. Because how you fuel your body says everything about how the body is going to thrive in life. So ultimately, guys, I hope this information is, you know, something that's made you more curious, that's got you maybe excited, that's maybe given you something to go, you know what, I think I need to try that. You know what, I need to get the Keto Reboot system before it goes away tonight at 11.59, and it's going to be two weeks before I can get it again on May 1st. I, you know what? I need to get a drink or ketone challenge. I need to try this for at least 10 days and see what these different flavors are all about. You know what? I need to just see more information and I need to talk to, you know, whoever invited you to this just so you can understand more about it. That's ultimately what this is about. So I'm going to stop the blabbering on my end and I'm going to open up the lines so that you guys can kind of do a Q and A. Uh, for anybody that wants to ask a question, you have a mute on your phone or a mute on the screen that you can unmute yourself. And I would love to be able to answer some questions. So let's go. Thank you guys for being on too. Don't be shy. I know somebody's got a question. Anybody, anybody going once, going twice, maybe. I'll tell you, this flavor right here is amazing. It's not available right now, but it's like a great, so good. And Josh is holding up a Swiss cacao. He loves Swiss cacao. I do too. That's the great thing about it. I get to pick different flavors. Karen, your your phone is unmuted. Did you want to ask a question? Um. Uh, well, first of all, I want to say happy birthday. Um. Second of all, thank you for recording this because my nephew, who is the chiropractor, couldn't jump on so I can send this to him. So I know um, his curiosity is up with this. 
I think once he hears it, then um, it'll give him a little more clarity with it. Awesome. Love it. That's what this is all about. It's just information. I mean, we ultimately want everybody to have information. And I had to hear it multiple times, but I can tell you that it was such a huge difference for me. The more information, the more I listened to things, the more I got educated about it. I mean, obviously, the one product did it for me, guys. It really did. I, 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 it was one serving for me. Um, I know Kelly Calabrese on here as well. She did one serving and was like, holy cow, like Shane, this is crazy. Um, Josh, I don't know about you. Was it one serving for you that did it for you? Or was it a couple servings? Uh, for me, I, I, it's, it's been a couple servings. Okay. Yeah. I, 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 I've, I've had, times where I've actually used it and have been hungry and there's also times that I've used it and I haven't needed anything for you know days <laughs> you know, right. I mean, it, 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 it hasn't been perfect in one way or the other but all I know is when I'm on them I feel better I just feel right. good yeah absolutely that's exactly right Exactly and you right. mentioned about keto adaptation and how it might be different for everyone. I was talking to Todd today. He's now on like day three and he's a triathlete and he's pretty clean. And so he's already, you know, feeling it, but maybe someone who's more toxic or a typical American diet or was eating a lot of carbs. So the adaptation may be different for different people. Yeah, no, I think keto adaptation is a huge thing for a lot of people to realize that your bodies go through you know, for some people like me, it was, it was one day. I mean, I adapted really quickly and my body utilized it for some other people. It can be a couple of days of keto adaptation before you kind of real, really feel it for other people. It can be a month. Um, I've had people that use the product for 60 days and then all of a sudden we're like, Oh my gosh, Shane, I didn't realize it changed this for me. It changed this for me. It changed this for me. I realized I haven't been grabbing a Coke. I realized I haven't been grabbing chips. I realized, Oh my gosh, I actually dropped four inches in my waist. Uh, uh, Shane, I'm actually sleeping two hours longer. I'm not waking up in the middle of the night. Uh, I mean, there are different things that everybody's kind of noticing, but for me, it was not being hungry day one. Some other things that kind of played about were the fact that my, I'm a natural bodybuilder. I took on natural bodybuilding at age 37. I just turned 45. My experience around natural bodybuilding is you have to get your body as lean as possible. You have to cut out all carbohydrates and you're just trying to maintain the muscle mass that you have. Well, anytime I'm six to eight weeks out from getting on stage and you're just trying to be as lean as possible, one of the hardest things about doing that process is that your body, you're trying to get into creating a new fuel source. And I didn't have drinkable ketones when I did my first couple shows. Guys, I felt, I felt weak. I lost about 30 to 40% of my strength. I didn't feel, I, I mean, I was always hungry. I never felt satisfied. Things were just hard. I started drinking ketones and then I started, you know, did another show. It changed everything for me because my body then had instantaneous fuel when I wasn't eating carbohydrates. And so that for me also told me, here's one of the other things about the bears and hibernation I meant to kind of, I meant to mention and I didn't, but guys, What's the thing about bears and hibernation that if they're sitting there utilizing and using all their body fat over a three or four month period, what's the first thing they come out of the cave and do? Not only do they have babies running around, but they also have to start what? Hunting and feeding. Well, if you haven't eaten per se or run or worked out per se in three or four months, well, how would they have any muscle left? How would they even have muscle that was even be a, a functionality? Well, because when ketones are present, they're actually anti-catabolic. It prevents the body from utilizing the glycogen stored in the muscle and the muscle itself from being metabolized. And that's a huge benefit. That's a massive benefit to understanding how this process works. Well, Shane, what should I focus on eating if I'm drinking ketones? Me personally, I just told you guys I ate brisket and jalapeno sausage. I focus on a lot of protein. Um, I'm probably 60% protein. I probably do about 30%, maybe 20% carbs. Um, and then fat is about 20 to 30%. It just kind of, every day is different. I don't, I'm not so regimented that I have to have this or that and this amount and that amount. I kind of go with what my body feels. And I honestly, I love whole eggs. Whole eggs have about 60% fat. I eat about six whole eggs at a time. 
Um, that's me, but that's a great source of protein and nutrients. I get a lot of vitamins and minerals and nutrients from my whole eggs. Um, I don't eat a lot of fat. I love, a you know, half a slice of avocado every now and then. I love making guacamole. I love, you know, all these different ideas of bacon is okay, but I don't gorge myself on bacon. I don't eat bacon every day. Um, so I don't want you guys to think that here's the other thing. People are like, well, do I need to follow a ketogenic diet? No, no, and no. Uh, because if I'm giving you what the end result of doing a ketogenic is all about, then no, you don't need to go eat a bunch of fat because I think people also have to realize one gram of fat, let me explain this, one gram of fat is two and a half times the calories as one gram of protein or carbohydrate. So if I go eat five grams, okay, of protein, like the brisket I ate today, right? Five grams of protein, and then I go eat five grams of fat, I had two and a half times more calories in my body because of the fat than I did eating that protein. Well, why does that matter? Well, calories matter at the end of the day. That's truly, I mean, it's a math, it's a simple math equation. Calories in versus calories out. And it's also about the fact that if I'm trying to burn fat, why would I go eat a bunch of fat, right? I mean, I would say easily 70% of, our adult society uh, is in a place of needing to burn some fat. So I don't need you to go eat a bunch of fat. I need you to burn fat. So I want you to focus on protein, good healthy protein. I want you to focus on veggies and salads. And then I want you to focus on some good carbohydrates. Um, that's, that's what this is really about. That's where we really gain the full knowledge and the full experience of what this can do for you and how it works. Because again, if I give you a fuel source in 45 calories and I can get you to reduce your caloric intake and actually even stop eating for maybe one or two meals, then that's a healthy balance. Then that's a relationship with food that everybody can be a part of. I, guys, I do intermittent fasting five to six days a week, which means I don't eat till three or four o'clock every day. Why? Why would I do that? Well, because I'm drinking this twice a day, so I'm getting all the fuel I need. And if I can fast for 18 to 20 hours, well, then I'm also increasing my, my testosterone naturally. Because men and women, because women, if you increase testosterone, guess what also increases? Estrogen. You have more estrogen than testosterone. But if we can increase testosterone, that means you're going to increase your estrogen. Well, as women age, the one thing that everybody needs is more testosterone, which increases estrogen. As men age, one thing that they need is more testosterone. What a good hormonal balance means? It means developing of serotonin and dopamine as well. The primary hormones that run men and women's functionality in the brain. If you have good serotonin and dopamine, guess what else that means? You have good melatonin. What does melatonin do for you? Melatonin helps you sleep at night. We all want more REM sleep. There's sleep and then there's REM sleep. If you can have more melatonin, that means you're going to have more REM sleep. My REM sleep in four hours beats your eight hours of sleep. Just a fact. It's true. And when people do the keto reboot, I think it's important for people to realize this. Kelly, I think you even mentioned this the other day. Kelly woke up at like 4.30 in the morning. She was like, I was wide awake at 4.30 in the morning. Why? Well, because her body was done sleeping. She was doing a keto reboot. She hadn't been eating. Her body was in a very healthy state. It had all the energy it needed. So when she went to sleep, she slept. I mean, she slept. And when the body said, you're good, guess what it tells you to do? Time to wake up. <laughs> and so it was like, is that normal? Yes, it is normal. Um, and that's just really one of the cool stories about how your body really thrives in ketosis, how your body thrives when it has ketones as a fuel source. Um, so I think that's just great information at the end of the day for everybody to realize it's not going to do it for everybody. Everybody's going to be different. So kind of going back to Kelly's explanation of keto adaptation, everybody's going to have a different experience. Just like Josh said, he can drink ketones and not be hungry all day. He can drink ketones and still be hungry. It's a different process at different points of the day, because guess what? Life is different every single day. The stress levels on life are different. Parenting is different. Whether you're just dealing with a job is different. I mean, life is different every single day. So 
it's not going to be exactly the same, but I can tell you, you are in a better state, in a better condition, and in a better place when you have premier fuel source running your anatomy functionality than you do running on grabbing a fast food, grabbing junk, grabbing something that you have to eat out of a bag, grabbing something that's frozen, grabbing something that's microwave, grabbing something, anything that is not this is going to be less than. I'm honestly, it's that's why this right here is greater than. Ketones are greater than what? Anything else on this side. That's ultimately what it's about. Ketones are greater than anything else on this side. You cannot create anything better for your body than what is already in this product. Um, and guys, ultimately, it's as natural as you can get. It's truly as natural as you can get. Why would we give it to our elite, elite athletes that are protecting our country, the Navy SEALs, and have them utilize it every day, day in and day out? Why? Because it works. Because it's sufficient. Because guess what? It goes anywhere. Just like us, life is going to be different every single day. So I think it's important for people to realize this is fast food to health. We all know fast food is not good for us, but we choose it. Why? Because it's fast. It's quick, it's effective, it's cheap. Guess what this is? Fast, effective, quick, and cheap, and even free. <laughs> if you want to know how to get it for free, then I can show you how to get it for free by helping two other people. That's what it's really about. And just as a customer, I don't need you to sign up for anything. I just want you to drink it and share it with your friends and family members. And as a customer, you get a referral bonus of getting free product. Not a bad gig, if you ask me. I get to drink. The only thing that tastes better than ketones are free ketones. So if you've never tasted free ketones, try it. They really work really, really well. I don't know about y'all, but I drink a lot of free ketones. Um, here's a really cool thing, guys. This is recorded, and um, if you would like the recording, please let me know. You can message me on Facebook, Instagram. Uh, you can shoot me any kind of message you want. Uh, but also, remember, this is an information session. Uh, we don't want you to feel pressured. We don't want you to feel convinced. Uh, we want you to feel educated and we want you to feel invited uh, to learn more. And we want you to have an experience because your experience will ultimately tell you everything about what you want to do with this product, what you want out of the rest of your life, where you want to go with this. You know, everybody's like, well, how long do I need to drink this? Well, unless you're producing ketones on your own, I'm going to drink it for the rest of my life because it's just working smarter instead of harder. You ever thought about that? I'm gonna work smarter instead of harder because in order for me to do it naturally, I have to literally watch every single morsel of food that goes in my body. I'm not really up for doing that every single day, especially a dad with four kids. I kind of got, you know, a little bit of some things in the kitchen that I'm not gonna keep myself in ketosis with, if that makes sense. Like I said, a red velvet cake yesterday, uh, and I love chocolate chip cookies that ultimately are my end game, but I have a healthy balance with them. So I don't eat them all the time, but when I do want them, I do eat them. So anyways, guys, I could go on and on and on. I think you guys should be in on this. I'm going to say one more time, if anybody would like to ask questions, I would love to answer any. So please feel free to ask away. You can unmute your phone. Are we good? You have the person that brought you this. Love each and every one of you guys. Y'all have a great night. Thanks, Shane.